Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm gonna be unboxing my December Fairy Loot. Um, as you can see, it's actually pretty damaged, the boxes. Um, by the way, checked inside and everything is okay, but yeah, I received this like a week or so ago, but I'm now getting around to filming it because life has been, been hard lately, but yeah, I'm very excited for this. Um, so let's go ahead and open it and see what's in the box. Um, so the only thing that came damaged is actually just a spoiler card, um, came a little damaged, but, uh, this month's theme was come one, come all for the month of December. So, um, yeah, and then it's just like this spoiler card on the back. Um, so the first thing here is, um, these face towels. Um, so yeah, here they are very cute i like that they included this little package or ribbon um and this is inspired by um the night circus um by aaron Rogerstern, uh, which i know a lot of people love that series but or love that book because it is a standalone but i have no i don't know it doesn't intrigue me for some reason to be honest but um this is very cute it's just circus tent on this um it looks cute so it's just a face towel um it's an okay item <laughs> to be honest so let's move on to the next item which is a book sleeve which i actually like um receiving book sleeves even though i never use them because i don't really travel with my books ever because i only read in my room basically um but i still like receiving them though they're very nice and this one is like they're keeping the circus thing going on um which i love it's a nice design, nice pattern, and then it says every person has the power to change their fate if they are brave enough to fight for what they desire more than anything by, and then the quote is by Stephanie Garber, so I'm assuming it is inspired by Carnival, um, so yeah, it is the Carnival series uh, by Stephanie Garber. Um, I like this, it's very cute, um, but like I said, I don't use them, but I like collecting them, because I have quite a bit, uh, quite, I have a... I have a few of these now, so, um, and I like receiving them, even though I don't really use them, but they're, they're very cute, and then the inside is some nice, um, soft texture in the inside, so I do like that, um, to put them up, but when I do travel, because I did use it once when I traveled, uh, last year, but it's very rare that I do take my books out, but they're very, very cute, I like, I like getting them, um, the next thing we have are bookends, which I like receiving bookends from Fairly because they're always so pretty. Um, and look at these. These are so, so cute. I think some people say they don't like these. Um, like, how can you not like these? These are so pretty. Um, I think they're gorgeous, to be honest. Hopefully you can see it, but it's like a carousel, and that's so cute to me. I love it. So it is a pair. Um, and they're, I like these. They're very cute. I don't really have I don't have a use for them though, to be honest. At least now, um, I have an empty room um, in my house um, that I want to build my library in. So I just need to buy bookshelves um, and make that happen. But these are so cute and I love these. They're very adorable. Um, and I don't think these are inspired by anything. Um, yeah, they're just inspired by this month's theme. But they're very, very cute and I love them. So I'm excited for these. And then I think the last items. Um, yeah, these are the last item before we get to the book. And the tarot cards are the um, uh, mythology bookmarks that they've been doing. Series that they've been doing every couple of months. And I love these. These are number seven and number eight. Um, which I love. I love receiving these. These are so pretty. Um. So they are Aphrodite and Aries, um, and they're so pretty. I love them. Um, they have nice, uh, like, rose gold foiling, orange foiling on them, and they're they're very cute. I love these. So I'm very happy with these. I love these a lot. They're very cute. Um, so yeah, this month's box, um, I enjoyed the items, to be honest, except for the face towel. Uh, actually, I do like it. So no, I like all the items. I, I love this box. This box is a pretty good box. <laughs> Um, so let's go ahead and show you guys the tarot cards and then we get to the actual book um, So we have the moon right here very pretty and then we also have the Sun right here um, And these are inspired by um, uh, Girls of paper and fire by Natasha Negan 
Um, I think that's how you pronounce her name, but these are so pretty. I have not read this series yet. Um, Illuminate Crate uh, just released special editions of this series um, that I do want to pick up and read. So I probably will do that soon because I, I really want to read it and these are very pretty. I always love their tarot cards. They're very nice. So yeah. Okay, so now we have the actual book here and it's a pretty thick book to be honest. The goddamn paper worms. <laughs> um, okay, so... Already, the stencil edges or digital printed edges are so pretty. Um, oh, I forgot. They, oh, okay. There's so much shit. I forgot that um, they come with um, a bookmark that's inspired by the month's theme art, um, the newsletter, or, or the fairy scoop. Uh, for next month's theme, it's Hidden wor Worlds uh, for the month of January. Um, and then just have an author interview if you're interested. Um, and then there's some, some exciting January releases. But yeah. Um, oh, and then we have the author's note here with a artwork print. And then behind it, we have the author's note. Uh, if you want to read that. Yeah. So now we have to actually have the book, which is Cruel Illusion by Margie Fuston. Um, this is a redesigned cover, and to be honest, I don't like it. But I also do not like the UK cover. It's very hideous. I love the US cover, so yeah. But it, I mean, it's not bad though. It's just, it's pretty simple. So I'm just not a big fan of it. But I do love the red foiling on it. Um, yeah, I just wish they did something completely different or something similar to the US cover, because I really like the US cover. But, yeah, and then we have these beautiful roses on just pretty edges on all three sides. So that's very pretty and I do like that quite a bit. So let's go ahead and take off the dust jacket. No um, artwork on the reversible dust jacket side. Um, and then, ooh, that's very cute. Um, so the only details we have on the actual hardback is just this character um, like outline on the actual hardback, which is very pretty and very cute. So that's very nice. Um, and then we can look at the inner pages. So yeah, the inner pages. I love these. I love the art style that they chose for the inner pages. Very pretty. And then on the back, I love this one. This one is probably my favorite of the, of the two. Very, very cute. Um, so I like the fairy loot does two different um, inner pages. And then it is signed by the author as well. So I do like that. Uh, that's very cute and nice. Um, so yeah, that's everything that was inside this month's box. Let me know your thoughts on the items and what they did to the book. Um, overall, I'm pretty happy with this month's book, um, box. Um, I just wish they did a different cover, to be honest. Um, but the items I love and overall I am pretty happy with uh, what they did with the book. So yeah. Uh, so yeah, uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!